making crafts in my shop. Why don't you come along with me to hunt for more shells? Come on! Wait, I almost forgot. I need some things before we go. I know just the guy to help out. Let's go. Hey, Marshman! Hey, Sandy, how you doing? I'm just sitting here playing my bongo, feeling the ocean vibe. What's the haps? Well, we're about to go look for shells on the West Beach. Always tell an adult where you're going before you explore. Is there anything we need before we go? Well, yes there is. Hold on now, let me check my chest. Got them. Sunscreen, bug spray, water, and a hat. When you go outside, you can't forget about that. But wait, I have an idea. Well, the fun in the sun stops being much fun when you're out in the sun all day. And you haven't put any sunscreen on to protect you when you play. Okay. Sunscreen, bug spray, water, and a hat. When you go outside, you can't forget about that. Sunscreen, bug spray, water, and a hat. You can't forget about that. Let's not forget about the bugs in the marsh. They really are cool to see. But if you don't apply your bug spray, they're no friend to you. Sunscreen, bug spray, water in a hat. When, when you, you go, go outside, outside, you can't, can't forget, forget about, about that. that. Sunscreen, bug spray, water in a hat. You can't forget about that. You can never have enough water, water, water. Never have enough water to keep you going strong. Woo! Last but not least, a hat. Sunscreen, bug spray, water in a hat When you go outside, you can't forget about that Sunscreen, bug spray, water in a hat You can't forget about that Sunscreen, bug spray, water in a hat Sunscreen, bug spray, water in a hat Sunscreen, bug spray, water in a hat You can't forget about that Oh, and these are the things you need for any adventure well, uh, thanks, Marshman. Okie dokie, artichokey. We're finally ready to go hunting for shells and other treasures. Let's go to the beach. Found one. When you go for a walk, you can see all sorts of things in nature, like this feather. Hmm, I wonder who this feather belongs to. Eh, too small. Uh-uh, too white. That's not even a bird! There, a vulture. This must be a vulture feather. A perfect match. Ooh, a conch shell. Before we look too closely, let's make sure there are no animals inside. <laughs> All clear. These conch shells are the homes of sea snails, and sometimes crabs live in similar type shells. So before you collect one, always make sure that it's empty. Only ever collect things that the animals are done with, like the shell or the feather. We never want to disturb an animal in its home. Since this one's all clear, I'll tell you a secret. Come here. Closer. Closer. Not that close. Okay. If you put a conch shell up to your ear, you can hear the sounds of the ocean. 
Let's try it. I can hear the waves. This will work even if you're far from the ocean. The next time you see a conch shell, try it yourself. But be sure to make sure it's empty first, or you'll get sea slug in your ear. Ew. <laughs> oh, we're almost at the tower. Come on, I'll show you. I can't wait to show you this view. Can I tell you a secret? I'll tell you at the top. Okay, here's the secret. I'm actually terrified of heights, but I'm not going to let my fears stop me from having fun. So let's go check out that view. You can see the whole marsh from here. I live in a marsh in Savannah, Georgia. Can you guess why it's called Savannah? One theory is that all that grass out there reminded the settlers of the African savanna, or grassland. But what makes a marsh different from a savanna is that the marsh grass gets flooded with water from the ocean. So right now, if you stood in that grass, you would sink up to your knees. The beaches of the marsh are my favorite places to find shells and other treasures. Besides collecting things, I get to see all sorts of animals. The marsh acts as a nursery, or a place for baby critters to stay safe while they grow big and strong. Oh, they're so cute! <sighs> it's a great place to live. Anyway, I better get back to the shop to turn these treasures into crafts. Let's go! Hey Sandy, do you need a ride? That would be great! Here's your life jacket. You can sit over here. It's important to listen to the captain of a boat. Captain True always tells the truth, so if she tells you to do something, you know it's important. Captain's boat, captain's rules. Hold tight! Thanks for exploring with me today. See you next time. Until then, grab an adult, go outside, and see what nature has to offer. making your own nature crafts. If you'd like to learn more about me and my adventures, click the link below and visit our website at seawithsandy.com. Like and subscribe! See you next time!